Today is World Mental Health Day, and according to the Department of Health and Human Services, 90% of Utahns have been impacted by suicide in some way. DHHS announced a first-of-its-kind suicide prevention training, this one all in Spanish. Fox 13 News reporter Lucy Nelson explains why it is so important for the local Latino community. A cada uno de nosotros en algún momento les... Each and every one of us, I can assure you, at some point, will need your help. That's a message from Jeanette Vialta, a social service specialist in mental health and suicide prevention. I'm a suicide survivor for 33 years. On my 19th, I thought that my life was ending, that I didn't want to live anymore. Vialta came to the U.S. from Guatemala and says, especially in Latino culture, mental health is a taboo topic and people are less likely to ask for help. In my community, in my experience, you don't recognize those signs. You don't know what is depression or anxiety. You're trying to survive every day. She and others with the Department of Health and Human Services are hoping to change that culture, announcing a campaign Tuesday with a suicide prevention training program called the Spanish Live On Playbook, which aims to help Latinos, their families, and friends who are struggling with mental health. Bienvenidos a la Guía de Prevención del Suicidio. Eight lessons, free and available on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube, which Executive Director of the Multicultural Counseling Center, Carla Arroyo, encourages everyone to watch for themselves, their friends, and their families. Support is essential for those who are struggling with suicidal thoughts. We must make sure that they know that they're not alone. It's a tool Bialta says she wishes her mother had when she saved Bialta's life at age 19. I'm thinking about my mother uh, and how this could help her to identify and, and help me at that time. And in her line of work, she says she sees families who need resources just like this. How many families will be, will be helped by having this guide in, in their lives and their, in their phones at any time? This is gonna be very helpful. And I wish we had that back in the time, but we have it now and that is the important part. In Salt Lake City, Lucy Nelson, Fox 13 News, Utah.